<laughs> That's the bottom line. But why am I showing you this? This is uh, Martinsville, Virginia Speedway on Pix 11. NASCAR tomorrow kicks off at 4. You see some cloud cover up there, but uh, I think they're going to be okay. Forecast looks pretty good. Again, 4 o'clock tomorrow on Pix 11. You can catch the entire race. Temperature wise, we should see numbers that are generally going to be in the upper 50s, about 59 degrees, with a partly cloudy sky and dry road conditions. So look forward to that. Meantime, we're talking about the November preview. Yeah, the normal high is 59 on this day. Now, of course, today we've made it up to upper 70s and low 80s in parts of the area, so that's way above normal. But we lose 10 degrees by the end of the month. Normally a little over three and a half inches of rain. And on average, we can get about a half inch of snow. There have been snowfalls higher than that. We've gone November's without any snow, and that tends to happen more often than not. 77 in the city, 78 in Belmont. We're still holding on to the warm stuff. A little sign of the cooler air starting to penetrate from the north. Newburgh, 68. You were in the upper 70s just an hour or so ago. So the cool air sitting right up here, you're going to notice it once we get past uh, 8, 9, 10 o'clock tonight, the temps will drop pretty quickly. So if you're going to be out, you know, you go out and you go, oh, I don't need a heavier jacket or a sweater or anything like that. If you're going to be out past midnight, you probably will, or you're going to be shivering a little bit because temps are going to drop pretty significantly, especially in the suburbs as we go through the overnight hours. So we cool it down quiet. Once again, no rain to worry about. High pressure in tomorrow, more seasonable temperatures, upper 50s, low 60s for most of us and for Sunday, Marathon Sunday. Runners delight. We start out in the 40s. We end up in the mid and upper 50s. Very seasonable for this time of year. Then the center of that high is going to move offshore again, and we get into a return flow. It's going to get warmer again next week. Meantime, Giants, maybe could both football teams win in the same week? This would be unbelievable. Yeah, tailgate temp about 53, climbing to about 56, halftime about 58 degrees. So nice football weather. It will be sunny. If you're in the sun, it'll feel a lot better than the shady seats. But nonetheless, 50 should do it tonight. We're talking low 40s north and west. And then tomorrow, looking at low 60s to upper 50s throughout the area. Quick look at your seven day. It's quiet throughout. Back to 60 Monday, but there are the 70s. Election day, 71. Wednesday, 74. It's still in the 60s. Thursday, Friday of next week.